Meanwhile, all students of Bantafargu Primary School in the Garo district of the Upper East Region are disappointed. Students of the school still suffer similar conditions which prevailed 26 years ago. At a presentation of items to the school, they blamed government for not fulfilling campaign promises made to the community over the years. Here's a report by Tanko Mohamed Rabio. Bantam Farugo Basic School with a student enrollment of 264 was established in 1995. Only primary one, two and three students study in a three-unit classroom block. The rest study on the corridors and in the open under the shade of trees. The students, though have sufficient furniture provided by the Northern Development Authority last year, but having to drag them outside daily would obviously reduce their lifespan. It is also under the school feeding program, but enrollment is still not impressive due to the harsh conditions under which some students study. It is painful that politicians come each and every time to solicit for our votes. But after elections, we see no one coming to our aid. So we are appealing and calling on the central government. We are calling on the district assembly for Garo district. We are calling on the MP for the Garo constituency to come to our assistance. Otherwise, this coming election 2024, we are going to drive away politicians from Bantafarku community if this school is not fixed. We are from KG1, 2, P1, P2 and P3. They are all using the trees as their classrooms. Cook is not the best for them. So they are appealing for, from, uh, for the government, NGOs and other philanthropists to come to our aid. The old students presented some teaching and learning materials to the school. We are very happy to the old students of Bantafaro Primary School for the presentation that they have made to the school. We are hoping that God will bless them and they will bring more items to the school. Especially, we are not having black boys to write. We are finding it difficult to teach. Now the children were not even having football to play. Now we can now have football for the children to play during break time. The Garo District Education Directorate is yet to respond to the infrastructure deficits. 